Hey what is going on guys Monster P and today it's raining I'm not sure if you can hear it but uh, if it's annoying I'm very very sorry about about that so as you can see I'm on Photoshop for an uh, FL Studio overlay for your stream even I don't really stream due to my inter low internet connection and yeah I was just boring and uh, don't know what to do today and this is why I did this tutorial so this is uh, the overlay here I just launch CSGO behind just to show you how it look, looks like sorry and as you can see I use different default overlay from FL Studio uh, this one for example for example sorry the main overlay of FL Studio I also have the um, piano roll to sh to show the webcam uh, unfortunately I don't have any webcam for the any webcam for the moment and I also use the pattern to display the music title here uh, you can download the package into the description and the plugin to show the title of each music you listen during your stream and it's completely free you don't need to install the software to display your the title it's uh, yeah, just copy the folder into your PC and that's all okay of course I have the game behind here and uh, we can continue the tutorial first of all we need to take FL Studio like so and here we can uh, take a picture of that so press the, the key button on your keyboard I don't know what is the name of the key in English but anyway take a picture go back to Photoshop uh, we're going to open a project by holding Ctrl plus N for the resolution it doesn't matter for me I will, I will take um, 19, 1980 no 1920 sorry and uh, for that 300 oops wait a second okay now we're going to hold Alt and double click on this thing here uh, we can create a new layer by holding Ctrl Shift plus N Press OK or you can just uh, click on this icon here uh, We're going to delete the layer 0 And we can copy our picture like so So first thing we need to do is to delete the taskbar under the FL Studio So we're going to take the selection tool which is this one you can hold your left click to show, to show the options and I recommend you the first one and we can select the taskbar like so now make sure to choose your picture here and press delete now hold ctrl plus D to unselect ctrl plus T to resize the image like so and press enter when it's done uh, okay we can continue to display the game here we're going to delete the playlist uh, by doing a selection again so do the selection like so and delete ctrl G to unselect and that's all we can continue by delete the text so I just zoom in uh, you have the, the tool here now we can select the text like so and we need the brush tool which is this one and we can um, delete the text of course we need to ch change the color click here choose the background color of the text and press ok now delete it uh, we're going to do the same thing for the text under the first one here take the brush tool and delete it uh, we're going to change to uh, delete this text to selection tool again uh, select the text and we need the brush tool uh, oops uh, we need to take the background color press ok 
and delete it like so. And we can add the text now um, by clicking, by choosing this tool here and uh, it will automatically create a new layer. Here I think I wrote welcome uh, like so. So for the font um, it doesn't matter, you can use anything you want. We can replace it by choosing this uh, tool and play with the, um, the, the arrows you have in, on your keyboard. Now we need to add another text here. I think it's last sub. Uh, sub. Like so, again we can move it. Or just make it bigger and we can continue to here add another text again so here top donator in here uh, last donator like so, we can also add a rules to align our text. Like so, and move the last one, the last text. In the rules, uh, we can move the rules up and zoom out. And that's all for the main overlay, now we can save it, so save it as a PNG folder, it's very important. Uh, now we can continue back to FL Studio and show the display the pattern here, we can delete this, this, this and that's all. Uh, for the piano roll, I will just resize it like so. Uh, like that, for example, and take another picture. Go back to Photoshop, we can paste the image here. Uh, now, select the tool selection and we just need the pattern so make a selection in the pattern hold control plus X control plus N okay it will automatically uh, do the resolution hold alt uh, double left click uh, no we don't really need to do this and paste your image now we just zoom it zoom in like so take the selection tool again and we're going to delete the the later uh, so choose the color and take the background color of the text uh, take the brush tool yeah and delete it as you can see it's pretty weird uh, we can see then we change something but it doesn't matter uh, take the text tool and we're going to write music like so we can also move it by selecting this icon and play with the arrows uh, now we can we need to delete the values point of the pattern so we're going to select this take the brush tool change the color again make sure to select your image and delete this it's done for this one so save it as a PNG again uh, back to the main project select uh, take the selection tool and take the piano roll 
hold control plus X, control plus N. Okay, control plus V. We going to hold Alt, double left click, delete the layer zero, add another one. Like so, I will just take this one under the first layer. And uh, take the selection tool again. We going to delete uh, the node space here and press. Uh, make sure to select your image and press delete. Control D to unselect. And that's all for the last image. You can save it as a PNG, of course. And you should have something like. Um, I will just show you. So this is the main overlay. Uh, we have also the webcam overlay, which is this one. And for the music, we have this one. So now, uh, I'm recording with, with OBS and I just want to show you how uh, to add your G overlay on OBS. This is why I will stop the video here and change my recording software. So yeah, I will be back soon. Okay guys, I'm back and I'm on OBS. So this is a streaming and recording software uh, completely free. Uh, you have a download link in the description to download it if you want and so yeah here we are going to add our image so right click here go to add and image um, we can call this one main over Sorry. overlay okay browse the image like so and press ok uh, you can also uh, click on preview stream we can add our others image so music overlay okay browse the image again this one okay uh, choose edit scene to move the image and you can also um, place uh, whatever you want like here and add the last one which is the webcam image uh, webcam overlay okay move it and uh, to add your webcam right click add and go to video capture device um, and you choose your the, the device of your webcam now we can add a game so right click add game capture okay and choose your game here so you need to launch before uh, your your game before to launch um, the game capture uh, and press OK. Now we're going to move down the, this source by right clicking and go to order, move to bottom, like so. Um, we're going to resize it uh, and just resize it like so. We're going to hold shift just to move the, this one. And that's all. Uh, yeah, for the music now, uh, right click, add text, and uh, music. For example, we going to set the scroll speed on 20 uh, to move the text, and uh, we going also to enable use text from file. Blah blah blah. Go to browse go to the uh, folder of SMG which is the software I use to display the music title and uh, here you're going to choose current song and open it press ok so now we can see there's already a, a track on it so this is uh, one of my, of my last track <laughs> Uh, we're going to open, we open the music uh, source 
by double left click clicking like so enable uh, use custom text and here the goals it's uh, to resize the text by changing changing here like so uh, we going also to change the font size uh, 13 for example press ok edit scene and that's all so for the software to add your music your music title I'll show you that you need to open the plugin uh, SMG on the folder you have you download earlier and you can use a lot of major player like uh, VLC or Windows major player uh, also use YouTube iTunes and yeah anything you want you can also add others major player here so ju you just need to browse it and uh, click here to add to the plugin and for me I use VLC uh, because uh, the Windows major player doesn't work really fine and this is why I use uh, VLC so I have some tracks here and when it's okay for you you can start click on start and the text should be displayed in your stream if it doesn't you can uh, close the software and reopen it like so and it should be okay so I can show you I can show you if I uh, change the music for example uh, it will automatically change the title of the music like so save the word and for the first one my remix on I need your love by Ellie Golding of course and it's done you can also add uh, other text for the last sub for exa example sub and uh, uh, write the nickname of uh, the last sub you can add also solve some scroll speed change the font size press ok and add it here uh, enable use custom text and make sure to enter the text uh, in this space but like so and uh, to display the last sub, the top donator or the last donator you have some website who will connect your Twitch or YouTube or uh, Dailymotion channel into their website and every last, last sub, top donator and last donation uh, and everything on a normal stream will be appear automatically in your streams so it means you don't know you don't need to change every time the name of the last uh, sub the last donator and yeah etc i think it's done for this uh, tutorial hope you like it uh, don't forget to hit the like button and uh, yes see you next time guys peace